trains here again welcome back to the channel hope everybody's doing well this week we have a special video that i really am excited to share with you all today as you can see by the title this is my york experience or the whole vlog i put together to showcase my experience antics and all the fun things we got to do this past weekend with myself and several other of your favorite youtubers that you're going to see in this video this video is a chance for you to get an idea of what York is like. York, for those who don't know, is t the TCA biggest train show of the year. It's held twice a year, in fact. It's held in April and October. And it's a three-day show in York, Pennsylvania at the fairgrounds. And you get to experience and see some amazing trains, talk to some amazing people, and just have to have get to have a really, really awesome time. Um, I want to take a minute to give a special thank you to a handful of people that I got to see this weekend. As you see by the shirt, I want to thank George and Wally, or GFW Trains, here on YouTube. They held a phenomenal tailgate on Thursday night of the show, and we got to have Chicago root beer, Chicago hot dogs, which I got to try for the first time, and you'll see my reaction later in this video of how I felt about those, because I am 50-50 on them, but after this trip, I love them. But... That being said, George, Wally, thank you for inviting me and several others to your amazing uh, little campsite on the fairgrounds. It was just a phenomenal night, and it was the coolest experience I've ever had at York. It was just so much fun to talk with you guys and talk with everybody else who was there um, about the hobby and uh, our overall experiences of the show as, as we started. You'll see in this video, I got to go for all three days, actually, which is a rarity for me. I got to go with Utaku Railfan and... He drove, me and him drove there with his two brothers, and we actually got to York early. We got to Pennsylvania early. We were supposed to go Friday, Saturday, but we actually got to go Thursday, and I was able to find something really awesome on the first day, thanks to my friend O-Gage Greg, who you'll see uh, his trains in this video as well. I also want to thank Chris Trains and Things and Sid's Trains, who allowed us to come to their homes and run on their amazing layouts and we just got to share and talk trains and just really enjoy this hobby because that's what this is all about for me it's more so the people that you get to meet and experience in this hobby and getting to share this amazing hobby we have with other awesome like-minded people it just it's so different and so great to do um but that being said you're going to see a lot of your favorite youtubers in this video from this past weekend i'm very excited to uh share it with all of you so sit back, relax, and welcome aboard. Hello everybody, good morning, and welcome back to the channel. It's Matt, or Matty C here again. Hope you guys are doing well, and this is a special video that is going to document everything that's going to happen this weekend. I'm taking you guys along for the ride as I go to the York TCA train show out in Pennsylvania. I am getting together with a lot of your favorite YouTubers in this video. You're going to see uh, JD Stucks, uh, Chris RBP, RJ's Trains, Sid's Trains, 
the list goes on. There's so many. This is like an all-star game. This is going to be an amazing time. Um, we are getting ready to leave. Um, I am waiting for Otaku Rail Fan to come pick me up, and we are going to go straight from Long Island and make our way over to York, or Lancaster, I should say, where our hotel is. And we're going to go from there, meet Steve K, and we're going to go to the GFW tailgate. So join me for this incredible journey, and join me for the ride. This is going to be an amazing time, and I'm so glad to share this with you all. So take care, and let's get started. Alrighty guys, so we are on our way. I'm here with Utaku Rail Fan. Hi. So uh, he's really excited. We haven't been to York in about two years. So Blake, you care to do the honors, my friend? Let's close, close this up and let's hit the road. All right, we'll see you guys there. Let's go. Alrighty guys, so we made it to York. Well, we made it to Lancaster, I should say. Uh, and surprisingly a very good time. In fact, we're early than we expected to get here. So we are probably gonna actually be able to make the Thursday, first day of the show, at least the last maybe two hours or so. And uh, we already have some friends texting us about some deals and some awesome engines that myself and a few others have been looking for. So York is already off to a great start. So we're in the hotel room here. So our lovely driver, Blake, is over there so he survived we survived getting out of new york very quickly so we're we're gonna go find uh steve k and the rest of the guys enjoy a little bit of the show and then it's off to the gfw tailgate so we'll see you guys there all right so i found the man i found steve k here so it's his first ever york he's very excited and uh we're heading over to the grounds now and we're gonna go have some fun and see gfw and enjoy the tailgate tonight so it should be a lot of fun see you there all right, ladies and gentlemen, we have arrived. As you can see behind me, we made it to the York Fairgrounds. So we are here. We're going to look for some of the crew and have a good time. So we'll see you in the halls. All righty, guys. So I'm here. We got Johnny, Jason. That's a very loud truck. Um, we got Steve K and Matt R up front of us here. We uh, came at a weird time. Unfortunately, a lot of the uh, uh, TCA member halls close at 5, which I did not know. So I ran in there really quick, and there was an engine... I've been looking for it for the last few years. You'll see towards the end of the video. But uh, fastest way I pulled out my cash. I mean, I'm a, I'm a predator at this thing. Freaking uh, quick draw McGraw over there, just whipping out his wallet. There. I know. Like 20s out the, 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 the wazoo. 
<laughs> so right now uh, we're on our way to pay a visit over to Lionel and Ryan Kunkel because the Vision Line, the new Vision Line locomotive, got revealed today. So we're gonna go give it a quick look see and check out the rest of the halls. So. Can I drool over it at least? Yeah. No, not not it? you, not you. I just found out about it a, like a couple months ago. You did? Okay. No? Um, um, he hasn't done one in forever. And it popped up, the one that was on yours, okay. popped up on your video. Okay. So it's like, okay, what are you talking about? Are you talking about some from him? He hasn't done one in forever. Alrighty guys, so we are here at the Lionel booth checking out the new products and uh, Johnny is over there with me with Jason as well. Guys, this is your first show and so far I can already tell. Wait, are you vlogging while I'm vlogging? Maybe. How dare you? I'm vlogging too. We could play this game. Cameras and cameras, that's great. And now Blake's gonna do it too, awesome. We could play that game. Great, but well, I'm gonna flip the camera around here. And you guys are going to see, here's some of the new product they got coming out, or some of the new releases that are already out. The Penzi Gen Set Switcher is really nice. You got uh, the 3001 re-release that's coming out. Looks absolutely killer. Up to it. As you can see, uh, this is it. This is the brand new Vision Line release. This looks absolutely amazing. Absolutely beautiful. Yeah. Thing over there. Look. Oh wow. You need that stuff here, All right, so this is the first time trying a Chicago hot dog. I've never had one in my entire life. I've heard a lot of things, some good, some bad. So here we go. Thumbs up, thumbs down. Oh, I forgot to tell you too. There it is. Oh, okay, first, all right, thumbs up. Thumbs up. Hey. That, is, that is very good. You eat it with the you eat it with the bowl, so you, you everything falls out. In the oh yeah. Bowl. No, that that's really good. He either hates it or or it's so good he likes it. Well, Blake went for a second bite, so either he's questioning it, or he's okay with it. Survey says it's not bad. Hey, oh, man, all right. You heard it here. There you go. All right, so that was day one, and it was a lot of fun. We're very tired, but we persevered, and we all got some really cool stuff. So I got my ticket item of the day, a, a K-Line die-cast 466T tank engine. I've been looking for one of these for many, many years, and finally have one. It's really awesome, beautiful engine. And Waco and everybody else, we all found something. So and so did Johnny and all the others. So tomorrow is probably going to be the hectic day, a lot of spending and a lot of uh, cool things to check out. So uh, we're going to go to bed and we'll see you guys tomorrow. All right, everybody. Good morning. We're here at day two of York, and we got the entire crowd here behind me. We got sit. We got the whole squad here. We're ready to go in and storm the castle. So uh, we'll see you guys in there. All right. So we're in the middle of day two here at York. So we got the guy. Some of the guys here. We got Matt Rochford and Johnny and everybody. So so far, Johnny did a good. Got a good deal. What did you get so far, man? I got uh got some Lionel Legacy Daylight PAs for five hundred bucks. Not bad. Mr. Rochford, what'd you get over there? I got a Santa Fe SW switcher from Atlas. My first Atlas ever. Nice. Very nice. And then this one here, he got probably the, he mo did the most, ex besides RBP, you've done some expensive uh, shopping today. So you got that new funeral set, right? Yeah, the Kate, the uh, Warring G. Harding funeral train. That is a gorgeous set. We're going to see that later tonight when we go over to Chris's and we'll see you guys later. We're going to probably I head think, out of here in a little I bit and head over to Strasburg. Okay? Alrighty guys, so as you can see behind me, we have the famous 475, and we have 
the first timers on the Strasburg Railroad with me. Y'all, so they, they're guy, they're, we're going to show them what this railroad's all about and why it's such a special place in our hearts for many, many people on the East Coast. So as I was recording the last bit, I forgot to include Johnny over here. I'm very, I am very sorry. <laughs> so, Johnny, sorry. being in front of 475, what do you think? I like trains. <laughs> really professional. This is the kind of crowd I got to deal with. We're gonna ride, and I'll, we'll we'll show you more clips as we go. Alrighty guys, so we just wrapped up here at the Strasburg Railroad with the Chicago boys uh, for their first experience. So Johnny, what did you think, man? Uh, it sucked. It was no, it was wonderful. <laughs> Don't tell me that. I'll throw you right under 475 right now. What an honor! Get crushed <laughs> to death by 475. <laughs> <laughs> Matt, what did you think? Uh, awesome. Awesome. Pretty awesome. Jason, what did you think of the ride? I loved being behind uh, old Chicago girl. Yeah. So for the people at home. She was actually from Chicago and it got bought by Strasburg and they brought it here. So the Chicago boys, I have to thank you for getting getting one of the most former engines here. Watch, J watch Jason be wrong about this information. No, it's not. And everyone's going to crucify you. Well, I blame you and it's recorded. So, all right, we're going to go find the rest of the guys and it's off to PA Chris's house and we are going to be running a lot of trains tonight. So we'll have a lot of fun tonight. So see you guys there.
Alrighty guys, so that is going to conclude day two of York. We had a ball. Oh, here comes a certain. Okay. Oh my. Okay. We're gonna. I might cut that. We might not. We might. Not. We will. We no, might not. I don't know. But uh, Chris, thanks so much for having us. This was an absolute ball. Um, this, this is amazing layout as always, and we we love destroying it, but also having a great time. But uh, we're here with the rest of the guys. You know, I'm we're tired. everybody's tired, but we're still having a little fun. But uh, this was an awesome <laughs> night, and uh, we're I'll see you guys all for day three. So Jason, what did we what did we find after all the searching? I found a Norfolk Southern GP40. How original! I know. I am so happy. Oh, I'm, I know you are. What are you buying, sir? Found it. Wow. Okay. Whoa.
her. All right, so we just wrapped up here in the Pennsylvania Railroad Museum. So, Johnny, what did you think of uh, the overall experience here? I liked it. Good. I liked it a lot. It was actually pretty cool. Um, I know uh, Chicagoans are, are partial to IRM, but this this place is presenting their, their equipment very well. Yeah. And you definitely get the sense of a big train station while you're there. Oh, yeah, definitely. No, no, shh, don't tell Jason I said that. He's yeah. such a... He's such a um, a rear kisser for IRM, so. <laughs> Alright, so we are going to go off to SIDS and have some more fun with a little less uh, big trains and more small trains. So we'll see you guys there. Alrighty guys, so we're here at Sid's Trains. Sid, we're running trains with Sid here. Thanks for having us over, man. No this is awesome to finally be at this layout. This is great. We got everybody else here. We got RJ. Finally got him in the vlog. I've been needing to get him in more. And he disappears. Great. We got Johnny again, and we got Jason here. So we're just having fun. We got the Blue Comet and the Thunder uh, Pacific out here. So this is a lot of fun. We're going to keep running some more trains, and I'll get you some more jumps.
So we have I'm Maddie so C sorry, here. Johnny. We have Maddie C here, and Maddie C wanted to say a special goodbye to everybody. <laughs> Good night, everybody. Good night, everybody. And also, you can't forget RJ. Hi guys. RJ is the is is the star star of this of the show. He's a star. Hi guys. Show. He's a superstar. Bye. I'm superstar. A star. But so everybody here from Long Hi. Island, everyone, not not the guy in red. Thank you guys. I will catch you in the next Bye. adventure. Bye-bye.